Hi everyone, in this tutorial we will demonstrate how to make uh, a high-rise building twisted tower in five minutes or maybe less using Dynamo technology. Uh, all the script and uh, Dynamo script and uh, uh, Revit, Revit file will be uploaded to my channel. Uh, in my channel there is uh, a complete uh, course and some file and some video also for Nevis work and the Dynamo or in my channel and it's free if you will subscribe you will get more video like this let us go for let us start uh, first of all we will define the geometry of the building how many axes four axes as the horizontal axis and the distance between axes is 4000 this is all parametric you can control you can make this 5 you can make this 4 you can make you can make it whatever you want and vertical axis like this uh, how many 5 in between there is 3.5 meter and a uh, twisted angle we will make the, the 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 building vertical first and then we will twist it uh, number of levels I assume it we need only uh, six uh, we can increase it of course and the level interval between the level and level I assume it four meters uh, let us get started and then we will explain it takes maybe 20 seconds to put all this element uh, it will put only the thin line of this one here yeah, center line of everything it will not put the element uh, you can upload everything, but it will take time. And uh, for small computer and small processor, uh, maybe it will uh, the, the the script will crash. So I advise you to make first the thin line. It will be a blue line like this when you yeah. and uh, included in the script. Uh, he create the the, the 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 levels and also create the uh, floor plans uh, we we assume it is six levels so we create six levels here uh, the script will be uh, free for download after i finish this i will upload it to my site uh, the script consists of uh, creating floors and creating levels this is the six levels which we created here and creating is a core and creating of uh, ground beam and floors and vertical column and inclined column when you twist it there is this column will be inclined will not be vertical like this and so on uh, let us uh, test the parametric of the building how it, it how it work now we assume it is uh, four axes let us make it uh, seven axes and then run it will be seven one two three four five six seven turn it back again to four and run in another direction it is five if you make it six or you make it four it will be four turn it back to five and then the distance if we make this distance instead of uh, three and a half meter six and a half meter it would be like this six and a half meter we'll turn it back again to three and a half I think it was three and a half or seven meter whatever okay uh, number of levels it is six now we can increase it to as a tower it will be 22 will be fine Then he will create levels and he will create all this thin line to make a tower like this. It looks nice tower. Then we start to twist. Twist the angle. We will assume that each angle six degrees. So we, he will twist this is six, six degree, this is twelve degree, this is eighteen degree. Let us see. So each one is twisted six degree to the above 
we can increase this to 11, 12, whatever. Yeah, now it looks nice. Okay. This is the interval between the distance. It is 0, 4, 8. We can increase this or decrease this. We will not waste our time. This is uh, to improve that this one is a uh, parametric. Now we will load the material, we will load the family. First we will load the foundation. The foundation here I assume to be pile. So we will unfreeze. I freeze it because I don't want it to upload it only one time. The script maybe will crash if your computer is not good enough. Run. He will give you here foundation and pile, then the ground beam here, freeze, run. This is the most important and interesting thing in in the in the video. And freeze. This is a vertical column. Vertical column is inside column around the circle here inside I assume it's this one and 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 this one. this is vertical column it, it formed the core of the because you cannot make all the the column as a structure wise to make it all around the building like this but at the edge you can make it climb as we will see now inclined column Freeze, unfreeze, and then the inclined column. The inclined column, it looks very nice. Really, very nice. The inclined column. Maybe the vertical column, we will freeze it again and then run to disappear. So we can see the inclined column so, and then the floor I should make the beam second beam and main beam first but I want to make the floor first just to see the beauty of the building this is the floor and each one is rotated maybe 8 degree or something, 11 degree, I remember, for the above one. And then, finally, we will do the vertical column and the ground, then the beam. It will take maybe half minutes to load all the vertical vertical column and beam underneath you can make it as a flat slab without any beams but if you want to make it a beam I make an option for this one he's building now the beams Thank you, finish. Yes, this is a beam. Now the file going to be heavy in each floor, and in the beam is parallel to the edge of this one, which means the beam is also rotated with the same angle for each floor. It looks very, 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 very nice. You can close now the Looks very, very nice. I already take some view before. This is view one for this one. A little bit more to show it. It looks very nice. 
and view to from above some people call bird eye looks very nice as I said all this file and all this uh, script will be uh, uploaded to my channel underneath the, the video you will find the link to download if you subscribe you will get more video like this thanks for watching